Kyleel here, bringing you once again an episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Cycle Nuzlocke Challenge. Uh, okay, so we got through the 8th gym, but unfortunately we lost one of our team players. That's fine. We lost two of our team players. I forgot about him dying. Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> So, I need to put Primeape up. I guess I didn't realize it in the last episode. That was my fault. Um, what am I going to get? Let's get... Let's get... Let's grab Sunkern once again. Sunkern should be really good to, you know, get through a lot of things that you might not be able to get through. So... We'll do that. Actually, I'll tell you what. Let's get Tauros. Let's get Tauros to start leveling him up. I believe we're here to move the leader. If I'm thinking correctly. Maybe I'm going to move Tutor. I don't remember. But I'm going to throw the experience share on him. Actually, I need to kind of heal everybody up first, too. Let's get everybody healed up. Alright, so now everyone's good and healed up. So let's grab the experience share. Give it to Nick. Alright, so we're gonna get Nick the experience share. We're gonna see what's gonna happen now. Let's see, we need to go to the dragon's den. Do I have do I still have anybody that can serve? Yes, I do, I still have Foxfire. Okay. It, it's hard to remember stuff every now and then. Alright, so let's surf on into there. Wait, oh, encounter. I think we've already had our little encounter, which wasn't... It's a magic card now, anyway, so... I think we already had the encounter. I'm pretty sure we did. I could be wrong. Okay. Now, this is a new area. And so, which means, technically, we can get an encounter in here. So, let's go ahead and roll, see when we're gonna encounter. <clears throat> we're gonna encounter in the morning. So let's change our time to 6.30 a.m. And to verify, yep, it's morning. Okay. So, Dragon's Den. I don't know what we're going to find. I think it's probably going to be Dratini's and Magikarp. Oh, we have a trainer. I don't realize there are trainers in here. Dragonair, Ice Shard, almost Oko. Okay, so that Dragonite, Dragonair, Dragonite, wow. So, let's see here. Calcium. So, let's see what kind of encounters we can get in here. Kind of curious. Anything? Maybe? What do we got? A Magikarp, Dupes Claws. Go away. What else do we got? We've got Magikarp, Dupes Claws. And we got Magikarp, Dupes Claws. Maybe all we're gonna get. Apparently you can't go that way. Oh, you're telling me I've gotta have Whirlpool? Dupes Claws. So apparently we're gonna have to have a uh, Whirlpool. Uh... <gasps> a Dratini! I'm gonna try and catch this thing. Our first dragon type of the game. And he really does not want to be caught. He really does not want to be caught. There we go, we got him. Dratini. It is born large to start with. It repeatedly sheds its skin as it steadily grows longer. <laughs> I can think of a bunch of different names I want to give him, but I... Uh... I'm trying to be more kid friendly for you guys. Trying to be. Really am. So we're gonna name him Saul. Name him Saul. S A L Saul. So it looked like we're gonna have to have Whirlpool. Great. Whirlpool. Do I have anybody that can learn Whirlpool? Do I even have it yet? Yeah, okay. Can anybody learn Whirlpool? Yes. 
Actually, I guess what we could do is have Nick be our HM slave. I really hate that term, because I know how powerful he can be. But I really don't want to give Polly Whirlpool, because I like Yawn on him. What else does he have? What else do we have on Polly? Mudshot's not 100% accurate, and it's not very strong. But it reduces speed, which is what I like. Hmm. And Whirlpool, well, Whirlpool's only a 70% chance. Let's give Nick Whirlpool. Oops, I hit the wrong button. So we'll give it to Nick. That way, he'll be kind of the HM slave. And I hate that term so much. I mean, if Whirlpool was a better... If Whirlpool had a better accuracy, I would probably potentially use it, but it doesn't, so I'm not going to use it. Alright, looks like, uh, looks like we have a double battle? I don't think we've had a double battle in a long time. Let's leave Larry up front. I'm going to heal him up a tiny bit, though. Do I not have any super potions? Yeah, I have super potions. Okay. I'd rather use the super potions up. It's almost full. We'll, we'll go with that and see. Double battle time! Double Dratini. That hits both of them? Um, I can't Earthquake. And I can't Surf. This will much shot one. I'm faster? He's faster? Wow. This is gonna hit both of them. I don't know if it's gonna knock them out. It knocked one of them out. It'll probably knock the other one out. It sure did. <laughs> so he knocked them out. Nice. Okay, here to 16. Actually, I'm gonna take the experience share off of him and give it to the other one. Classy. Ouchie meanies. Yep. Let's see. Oops, wrong one. Item, take. Item, give. Give him the experience share. Okay, so we got the experience share on him. Grab this, I guess. Max elixir. Okay. Not bad. In order to get that item, you'd have to actually come up here and face them, so that's no big deal. Looks like we got a trainer right there, too, but that's just got a max potion. Let's do the trainer just to see, you know, more experience points. Horsey. Well, then. Mmm, that horsey might be a bit of a problem. Let's see what I can do with close combat. Yeah. A Seedra. I would stay in, but the special defense went down, and they're they're really specially high. So I didn't do very much. I didn't do very much either. Horsey. Okay, I'll go back to Mega Horn again. Oop, wrong button. There we go. Okay, so I just wanted to kind of do the trainers, you know, see what they've got. All right, let's see if we can get through this whirlpool. Splash, splash, splash. Okay. Magic car. We've already done our encounter here, so we're just gonna get rid of it. Oops, I'm actually not ready to go through here yet. Let's see what else is over here. Magic car. Again. What do we got now? Magic car. Oh, joy. Let me guess, another magic car. Yep. Oh, I didn't quite get him on that one. Alright. The Pokeball. <gasps> the Dragon Fang! Yes! Except we don't have anybody that has Dragon Moves! <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh well. We have a Dragon Fang now for when we do get... I almost want to level Dratini up. I do. Whoops. Do any items. I don't see any items. 
Alright, so let's keep going. So let's go in, do our little whatever you call it, and then we'll be done. Okay. Hello. Good to see you here. No need to explain why you came. Claire sent you here, didn't she? That girl is a handful. I am sorry, but I must test you. Not to worry, you're to only answer a few questions. Ready? What are Pokemon to you? Friend. Oh, I understand. What helps you to win battle? Strategy. Oh, I understand. What kind of trainer do you wish to battle? Anyone. Oh, I understand. What is most important for raising Pokemon? Love, I guess. Oh, I understand. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. Which is more important? Both. Hmm, I see. You care deeply for Pokemon. Very commendable. That conviction is what is important. Don't lose that belief. It will see you through at the Pokemon League. So, how did it go? I guess there's no point in asking. You did fail? What? You passed? That can't be! You're lying. Even I haven't been approved. Claire, this child is impeccable in skill and spirit. Admit defeat and confer the rising badge. Or must I inform Lance of this? I... I understand. Here, this is the rising badge. Hurry up and take it from me already. And now we have the final badge. The rising badge will enable your Pokemon to use the move for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokemon will know you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. Claire, reflect upon what it is that you lack, and this child has. And she just runs off. By the way, have you heard of Lugia? It is a Pokemon said to have lived around Royal Island once. Never mind, just mad words of the old. Okay, so... Oops. Okay. So now we can get out of here. Yay, finally. So... I don't remember, but can I wait? I think I can wait to do the legendary. Another one? Grief. But yeah, I think I can actually wait to do the legendary. Hi, Dratini. Hi, Dratini. I'm sorry about this. Here, take this as my apology. Yay. That contains Dragon Pulse. Well, Dragon Pulse is kind of... Uh, never mind. It's huge energy of some kind. If you don't want it, you don't have to take it. What's the matter? If you are headed to the Pokemon League, go back to New Park Town and surf along Route 27. Your face is telling me you have some unfinished business. Come on. Whatever you have to face from now, don't you dare give up. If you do, I'll feel even worse about having lost to you. Give it your all. Alright. So now, I'm actually going to go get Dratini. Ah. What was his uh, voice? Oh, hello there, Kalu. How's it going? I've gotten bits. I've gotten a hold of something pretty neat. Something here, you know. Swing by my little lab right here and pick her on up. See you later. Alright, so, yay. Pokemon. Oh, wait. Stop. So, before we do anything, I am going to go get Dratini. And as much as I would love Tauros to stay in the party and be our HM slave hate that term, but I would really rather have Dratini. And I don't 
I know we're potentially going to be needing Whirlpool. So let's see, who do we not need? Hmm. Well now, that's actually a hard decision right there. We have two ground types, actually technically three ground types. So for now, I need to keep both of them because one is ice, one is water. Really, I already have both of these types. Oh, wait, I need to take the item off. So I need to take the item off of him. I am going to get rid of him, unfortunately, of Gligar, because I don't really feel as though I need him right now. Yes, he's got dark type moves, but I'm not too worried about it. I'm hoping eventually Heracross is going to get a bug move. I'm hoping. I may be wrong, but I'm hoping. Um, otherwise, we're going to... We may just have to figure out who we're going to use and go from there. Now, once we get to the Pokemon League, then I might switch Gly... No, I won't switch Glygar back in because I'm afraid of having three flyers, two being ground. Right, technically, two flyers, three ground types. I mean, ground is great and all, but, you know, it... They, they have their weaknesses, and I mean... The Elite Four is going to completely annihilate us, probably. In my honest opinion. I'm not even... We're not even there yet. And I'm already telling you. I'm pretty sure the Elite Four is going to annihilate us. But I'm going to go ahead and buy some full restores anyways. <laughs> so, we can start getting the full restores, which means... I'm going to start selling a few things off now. That we, oh, we have two nuggets that I'm going to sell off. Sweet! Oop, not the smoke ball. Not the smoke ball. I would really like to keep the smoke ball for a little while. Uh, let's see. That revive can go. Oop, not the super potions. I'd, th I'd rather keep the super potions for just a bit longer. How much are those moon balls worth? They are worth 150. Okay, not too worried about those. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab a few more full, re full restores. Because we're probably going to be needing them. Okay. So let's get going. Let's go back to Newbark Town. Alright. Crobat, fly us away. We. Oh, try again. There we go. So, we. We are here. Now we gotta go back by the lab. Oh. Kalil, did you already collect eight badges? That's so cool. The professor is waiting for you. Mm, yes, hi, Kalil. You never cease to amaze me in this old lab of mine. Mm, yes, and thanks to you, my research is going great. Mm, yes, take this as a token of my appreciation there, buddy. It's this wonderful little master ball here. It's the best. It's the ultimate Pokeball. It just can't... It'll catch anything without fail. It'll even catch your mom, if you know what I mean. <laughs> it's given only to noted Pokemon researchers. I think you can make much better use of it than I can there, Khalil. Mm, yeah, right there, buddy. By the way, we just had a group of beautiful, beautiful looking kimono curls looking for you. Mmm, yes. Khalil, people are talking about you. I heard you helped kimono curls. You've been helping all these people. You make me proud to be your friend. I'm going to go away now. Mmm, yes, the kimono girls are waiting for you at the... <laughs> critique Dance Theater. Mmm, yes, now please leave me be with my loveliness here. Alright, anyways. <laughs> so, back to Ecritique City. Now, if I remember correctly, and I probably don't, the Kimono Girls have all five of the Eevee evolutions. And we have to face them all back to back to back. So I'm going to heal up first. Wow, he's actually level 11. I didn't realize that. Let's see what he's got. He's got Rap, Leer, Thunder Wave, and Twister. It's not bad moves. So it's not bad moves. What was it? It's Gentle Nature. What is that? Up Special Defense, Down Defense. I mean, it's not too bad. I'll take it. I'll definitely take it. But I'm going to go ahead and give him the experience share. 
because he needs to gain a lot of levels. I'm already guaranteeing he will not be Dragonite by the time we end this playthrough. <laughs> Assuming we make it through the Elite Four successfully. Okay. So, oh, thud. How? How is this possible? How can I lose to mere kimono girls? Hmm. You were watching me, Khalil. Yeah, that's right. I never thought defeating five kimono girls would be so hard. I got beaten to a pulp. You must have come here for the same reason, right? Don't get cocky just because you defeated that Team Rocket. These kimono girls are insanely strong. Go ahead, see if you can defeat them. But I'm not going back. I don't want to see you win. Get out of my way. Alright, anyways. Yay, the kimono girls. Oh, it just pulls you right in into it. Welcome. My name is Suki. I met you previously in Violet City. In order to bring back home, we need someone with the right bond with Pokemon. We asked Mr. Pokemon to give this mystery egg to whoever showed true potential. The egg was eventually handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm and then to you. However, being pure alone will not be sufficient to face the power of this Pokemon. <laughs> I must test you. Are you ready? Oh. I will test how closely you bonded with your Pokemon. Okay. Umbreon! Okay. I didn't expect Umbreon off the bat. I really did not. Um. Earthquake? Ooh. That may do a lot. It did 40 and it flinched. Oh, that confused Ray, though. No, 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 no. No confusing me. I, I can't afford that right now. Polly is confused. He used Earthquake, oh, thank goodness. So, the one thing I was kind of worried about was the Vaporeon coming first. Apparently, I was wrong. And I'm going to go ahead and switch to Megahorn. Because Megahorn can probably take the Sunbreon out pretty quickly. Dark Pulse. It's not very effective, but let's see how much damage it Oh, it did 11. I'm close combating this thing. I know it reduces my special defense, but if I can knock it out, which I did, which is <laughs> with a critical hit, by the way, that's what I wanted to do. So Polly grew to 39. Megahorn almost leveled. Saul is going to gain a few levels here. To 12. Oh, nope, just one level. I don't have any Pokemon left. Oh god, I think I'm gonna use the same voice for them all. You are quite strong. You helped me in the Ilex Forest. My name is Nainako. Naoko. Naoko. Naoko is someone that's not good with directions. My eyes witnessed you defeating Team Rocket when Kurt was in trouble at the Slowpoke Well. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. <laughs> Apparently, I'm failing with names too. All right. Ne 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 Nike ne Naiko Naiko ne Naoko I don't know. Anyways, I'm about shot. Uh, this might hurt. Oh god, don't don't. Ooh, that was close. Woo! That did a lot. And I don't have anybody that can withstand a psychic move. Ooh, I'm gonna have to go with my gut. Wait, my gut's not feeling well. <laughs> Anyways, here comes a psychic. Please don't do too much. I can't take another one. Let's take a look here. Who's got... He doesn't have very high. He does... But my problem is, he's super effective against it. He does too, but he's super effective. Nope, nope. Polly. Man. I'm not losing Polly. 
the heck with that? Let's see. I bet Larry will take about the same amount of damage, but I can get an Ice Shard off, I hope. Okay. I can get an Ice Shard off. The question is, is it going to be enough to knock this thing out? I do have the Never Melt. Wait. Before I do anything, I want to check something. Summary. He's got higher attack. Ice Shard is physical. Okay, so he's got a high attack. Alright. You know what? If I, lo if I lose him, I'm gonna kill myself over this. Alright. Let's do it. Let's see if this will be enough. Go, go. Oh, it wasn't enough. Oh no. Am I gonna lose him? Oh, I lost him. Oh no. No, 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 no. I just lost him. I needed him. Okay. We did good until that point. Oh man. I was afraid of that. Oh, you're truly strong. Oh, I lost him. Okay, now it should be the three. So I'm wondering... Oh, I remember you chasing off the Team Rocket Grant from right here. I must thank you for that. Although, I am actually a trainer myself. She who knows the most speaks the least. I am Miki. The Kimono Girl. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Okay. Uh, I cannot believe it. Okay, Flareon, you're gonna be dead. Uh, stab. Will o Wisp! Okay. I wasn't expecting that. I gotta surf. Oh, no, it didn't even Oko it. Uh, that did actually quite a bit. Let's. You know what? I hate using one right now, but I'm gonna use one. What is she gonna fire blast? Don't do very much. Okay, didn't do very much. <laughs> Earthquake? Will Wisp. Ah, yeah. Okay, anyways. So Saul is going up. Oh, I completely missed her saying. What do we got next? The Vaporeon? Excellent fighting spirit! You got me off the ice by pushing me from the back! I am the one who skates in sandals! I am Sayo! The Kimono Girl! I was listening in the Dragon's Den when you passed the test of the Elder! Allow me to challenge you and your Pokémon! Uh... <laughs> so, who's this one? Jolteon! Okay, I'm not even worried at all about Jolteon. I should just be able to Earthquake it. Oh, <laughs> double team, of course. But I'm afraid... Ooh, that didn't even do enough. Oh, I am burnt, that's why! Status full heal because I don't. I'm pretty sure I don't have burn heal. Okay, yeah, your double team is gonna get very, very annoying. And I still got the earthquake off. <laughs> so Saul is gaining some levels. It's gonna take a little while for him to level up. Dragon Rage. Yes, please. Actually, I really don't want Dragon Rage, but I'll take it. Get rid of Leer. So close, I almost had you. No, you didn't. Not even close. Oh, which means here comes the Vaporeon. This is gonna be a tough fight. You were so dependable at the Golden Rod Tunnel. I am the one who twirls even underground. I am Cooney, the Kimono Girl. I looked at you in wonder when you thwarted Team Rocket's mission to take over the radio tower. You must show your strength to me now. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Uh, okay, so, uh, really what I'm worried about is this, this thing right here. I'm 
trying to figure out who I can switch to and be safe. I think I can switch to Ultrasonic and be safe. I don't think it has an ice move. I'm hoping not. Let's find out. Surf. How much is this going to do? 45. Okay. So I can take one more. I'm going to go ahead and fly. And I missed. Go figure. Why is fly so undependable? <gasps> it does have a nice move. But, the, okay. So it does have a nice move. It didn't do as much as I thought it was going to. I confused it, which is what I kind of wanted to do in the first place. Yes! Some damage off on it, finally. How about a poison thing? I got it even poisoned! I don't... Uh, please don't knock him out. Please, no, stop! Stop! Oh my god! Oh! I, I could not risk losing him again, or her again. Oh! Now I can just sit here and stall. Whoa, what am I doing? Now I can just sit here and stall. That quick attack, though. So, I mean, I could sit here and stall, yes. I am going to do Poison Fang again, though. Last Resort? What was that move? I've never seen Last Resort. And a Wing Attack should knock it out. Yep. Oh, man. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Oh, that was close. I don't know what I would have done if I lost Ultrasonic again. I, I just don't know what I would have done. Oh, you are wonderful! We were not wrong about you! You are indeed worthy of this! Please, take it! The clear bell. Hey sisters! I just saw the big shadow of a Pokemon over the bell tower! Hi, Lil. We'll be at the bell tower. See you there. All right, so uh, I cannot believe I just lost my pillow swine. That sucks. After all we've been through, and I lose him. That really sucks. Okay. Oh, so my question is, how am I even going to fix this? I need somebody with ice type. I need that. Or even somebody with that can learn a dragon type move be besides a dragon type, you know. Uh, who am I gonna get? Magikarp. Yes! That's it! I just got a brilliant plan that might not work, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. <clears throat> okay. So pretty much, I need to train. I've got to do some training, unfortunately. I got to do a lot of training. Yay. So I'm going to end the episode right here for today, unfortunately. Because I've got a lot of training to do. So probably Monday's episode is going to be all about training, training, grinding, and more grinding. Ugh. All right. So I want to thank you all so much for watching. If you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, give me a thumbs up as well. And we'll see you in the next video.